hello viewers in today's class we are going to discuss yet another uh, concept in three dimensional geometry and that is how to find the equation of a plane passing through three non collinear points right so here uh, we have a problem find the equation of the plane passing through uh, these three uh, non collinear points right so uh, before uh, uh, solving this problem let us consider the case of uh, collinear points now uh, we know that uh, three points are said to be uh, collinear points uh, if they lie in the same straight line right suppose we have a point a uh, then point b and here we have the point c and let us say the coordinates of these three points are x1 y1 z1 x2 y2 z2 and x3 y3 z3 right and uh, let us take these uh, three points a b c as collinear and we have uh, these three points in the same straight line right now uh, when uh, we have three points and we are to find the equation of a plane uh, passing through uh, these three points then uh, we have a plane like this right see this is the uh, plane uh, which uh, passes through these three points similarly uh, we can have uh, another plane say uh, this is the plane uh, which passes through these three collinear points right similarly we can have a plane like this which passes through these three points so it shows that when have, whenever we have uh, uh, three collinear points then we have an infinite number of planes passing through these three points right but whenever we have three non collinear points then we have uh, a unique a plane uh, passing through uh, those three uh, non collinear points right suppose we have here p then we have q and then we have r right and the coordinates are x1 y1 z1 here we have x2 y2 z2 here we have x3 y3 z3 and then in that case we'll have a unique plane passing through these three uh, non collinear points and whenever we have three collinear points then there may be an infinite number of planes passing through these three collinear points now here in this problem we have to uh, find the equation of that unique plane which passes through these three uh, non collinear points now viewers uh, the equation of a plane which passes through uh, three non collinear points is uh, given by uh, the determinant uh, that is x minus x1 y minus y1 z minus z1 then we have x2 minus x1 y2 minus y1 z2 minus z1 and here uh, we have x3 minus x1 then y3 minus y1 and z3 minus z1 right so this is the equation of the plane uh, which is in the form of uh, a determinant uh, which passes through these three uh, non collinear points so this is x1 y1 z1 this is x2 y2 z2 this is x3 y3 z3 right now let us substitute the uh, values of uh, uh, x1 y1 z1 x2 y2 z2 and x3 y3 z3 in this determinant so now we have uh, x minus x1 that is 2 then we have y minus y1 that is 1 here and z minus 0 and uh, here we have x2 minus x1 so we have 3 minus 2 then uh, y2 minus y1 so we have minus 2 minus 1 then we have z2 minus z1 that is uh, minus 2 minus 0 and then we have 
x3 minus x1 that is uh, uh, 3 minus 2 and then we have y3 minus y1 so 1 minus 1 and here we have 7 minus uh, 0 right so now we have a simple determinant here and we have x minus 2 this is 1 this is 1 y minus 1 here we have minus 3 this is 0 this is z this is minus 2 and here we have 7 right now we can uh, simply uh, expand uh, this determinant along the uh, first row and uh, we have x minus 2 and then we have uh, here minus 21 and here we have 0 then we have minus y minus 1 and we have uh, 7 plus 2 and then we have z and we have 0 plus 3 equal to 0 right now we can so now we can simplify it so we have now minus 21 x plus 42 then we have here 7 plus 2 9 so we have minus 9 y plus 9 and then we have 3 z is equal to zero right okay so now uh, we can further write it as minus 21 x minus 9 y then we have 3 z and 42 plus 9 uh, that is uh, 51 right and uh, now uh, we can uh, multiply uh, this equation by uh, negative 1 so we have uh, 21 x plus 9 y minus 3z and minus uh, 51 is equal to 0 right so viewers uh, the Cartesian equation of the plane uh, passing through these uh, three non-collinear points is given by this equation right and we can also write the uh, vector form of this equation as uh, uh, vector uh, r dot 21 i cap plus 9 j cap minus 3 k cap minus 51 is equal to 0 right 